seeded UCF took on in-state rival and third seeded University of Florida for the SIRC Conference semifinals. UCF would open the playbook first, Abigail Hudak would get the pass, and POW! Stiff arm and nothing but space, breaking tackles for the first try of the day, UCF up 7-0. Florida was not giving anything away this game. Huge run by Lindsey Corrin would set Florida up deep, deep, deep inside UCF territory. Coming out the ruck, Mariah Saunders would take the crash down to the try line. Jennifer Smith would close the phase, getting low for the score. Florida up 10-7. Jennifer Smith was not done yet as she would get her second try of the game on another forward crash. Florida up 15-7. Gabrielle Zabian with the big pass to Shaney O'Connor. And O'Connor would whoop, burst around that corner, getting the ball in for the score. Florida goes into the second half up 15-7. UCF was not ready to give the game away. Lauren Hartwood would get the ball and smash through that Florida defense being taken down at the try line. Georgette Reinstein would take the ball off the rug, close with the score. Florida still up 15-12. Florida turned up with a huge run at the edge by fly half Gabrielle Zabian. This became a duel of the fly halves as Courtney Cool would take the ball and make the fake cut in and boom, rumble in for the score. Neither of these teams were giving anything away. Florida showed out. Kelsey Rice would show that boom, boom, lightning speed. Giving nothing but space to the try line. Florida up 25-17. UCF responded with their own speed run. As Courtney Cool would take the ball and get to the outside space of the defense. And base mode it in for her second score of the day. UCF trailing 25-22. Brianna Pantajona would not be refused as she barreled through the Florida defense and put UCF in the lead for the first time in the game. UCF up 29-25. Within the last five minutes of the match, the speedster Kelsey Rice would put the team on her back and whoo, dust her the UCF defense for 22 meters. Only seconds remaining on the clock, UCF would grind it down the field. A last attempt pass from Courtney Cool to Segoya Gooden would give Gooden the space to make the game ending try as she was tackled in for the try. UCF would get this game 34 to 32 at the last second. UCF would move on to take on life in the championship, and Florida would take on Florida State for third place.